All right, so as you guys can see in the title today, I'm doing a story time. I haven't done this in legit two years. It's been a long, long time since I've done this. And like back then, that was back when I played Fortnite. I was what, 13 years old? And it was a shitty story anyways. It's part, the video is private now. You guys are OGs, OGs. You guys remember that story time about the stupidest teacher I've ever had? This is the exact same story. I'm just gonna be telling the story even better because back when I was 13, man, I did not know how to tell stories for shit. Today, we're back on Vanguard. I'll probably just play some free for all while we talk about the story. Yeah. Also, it's high as shit today. So, my window's open. If you guys hear like cars going by or wind or whatever, I don't even know what goes. Whatever outside noise, it's because it's hot as shit. So, we're starting at the slimmer weather again, man. Like, sure, it's beautiful outside. It's like it's beautiful outside, but it's hot as shit. Especially when I'm playing games and everything, and then like hot air comes out of my PC, man. Ooh, redstone. Nice. I actually kind of like I used to hate this map, but I actually kind of like it now. Ooh, should I use the automaton or the Tommy gun? I'm gonna use the automaton because it's kind of a far range map. This story took place in grade seven, so that was three or four years ago, man. Holy man, there's what should I even start with? There's a lot in that, that happened in that class. Let's just start with this. You wouldn't like you know, sometimes you have teachers that don't have the best English or whatever you want to say, and you wouldn't think that a teacher that doesn't like isn't like fluent fluent in um english would be an english teacher right but somehow she was our english teacher like she spelled so many things wrong i forget okay so she was our social oh, shut the fuck up J Chase, whatever fuck your name is. Yeah, J Chase is his name. She wasn't like extremely fluent in English, right? And like, I don't, how the fuck did I, I didn't go past it? And she was an English teacher, man. She was our English teacher, our socials teacher, and our English and socials. Was that it? No, there should be more, not science. Wait, do we even have science? No, we did have science. No, she wasn't our science teacher. I think she, I, all I remember is that she was our. English and socials teacher. There might have oh and careers teacher and careers teacher. I think fuck me. I forget. Okay, for sure, for sure. She was our English teacher and socials teacher. Forget everything else, everything else. Yeah, she was not fluent in English at all. I remember she spelled Dude, shut the fuck up. I keep on trying to mute these guys. She spelled earthquake wrong, rainbow wrong. Um, what else did she spell wrong? At that time as well, I was in French immersion, right? So like everything, like mostly everything was in French except English. And she even spelled things in French wrong. Like she wasn't fluent in fucking in French and English. Actually, I can't really say shit because I'm not. I, no, I'm, I'm pretty fluent in French. I would say I know what to, I know how to make a like how to start start a conversation, like how to hold a conversation pretty well. Oh my god. Are those like concussing bullets or something? Cause I got concussed whenever he shot at me. People never took the class seriously. Like, like it's like, everybody took that class as a joke. Cause she would always like, she would like get mad when he did something, right? But she wouldn't do anything about it. So then people took, took like advantage of that. And like just did random shit. Like I remember this kid, Um, I'm not gonna say his name. There was this kid, right? We were in portables, right? We were in portables. Both our classes were in portables. So in the portable, right? There was this little like little spot in the back of the class or like to the side of the class where you can put your coats and everything in there. This kid, literally hid in the fucking coat room and for the whole like three hours of class he was just in that fucking coat room it was like and all the kids knew about it right so i think i think it was english as well so like kids were just like we were just reading books or some shit like that right so some kids went back there and fucking um and like when they go talk to him and everything so the teacher noticed that right she went back there and she noticed that like the kid was there she's like she's like go to the office okay he's at the office he tells the principal that she's an english teacher and he didn't even know the fucking principal didn't know that, the, that our teacher was an English teacher and she was not fluent in English. Holy shit, we're not 13 kills right now. Ah, oh, fuck. 14 kills she got ruined right there. Like, that was. It's fucking crazy, bro. Our principal. Our principal didn't even know that she was an English teacher. And, like, I remember also, um, because, like, me and my friend Elliot, it's actually his birthday today. Happy birthday, Elliot. I fucking love Elliot. We, we didn't take the class serious. Like, I, even I didn't take this class seriously. Like, no one did. No one. I, I'm not, I'm not really, uh, like, afraid to say that. Like, I did not take the class seriously. Like, the teacher didn't take anything seriously, so why should we take anything seriously? Like, she's legit, she's legit our English teacher when she doesn't even know fucking English. Like, that makes no fucking sense. I remember whenever, like, people would, people would go to the office, right? Are literally the, the, like, the principal and the vice principal knew that like there was like no reason for us to go to the principal's office so they were like did madame Vu oh i almost said her name did madame uh whatever whatever uh tell you to come to the office they're like yep okay and they're like okay go back to the office or go back to the class then it was funny as well right because like she was a nice teacher i'm not gonna get i'm not gonna lie she was a very nice teacher she was just a not a good teacher like she didn't teach like <laughs> she didn't teach as a teacher i guess you could say i remember i think like near the end of the, at the end of the year me and my friend we didn't give a fuck anymore we were throwing pencils on in, around the class sure this sounds bad like that we would throw pencils around the class and i remember one of the pencils went out you know like you know in, in school right we have those like kind of like tiles i guess you could say in the roof like, our fucking pencil 
went through the roof and it was like it stuck it, it stayed in the roof it legit it was in the roof it was hilarious um i know this sounds bad but i would actually i would never do this nowadays i don't know what the fuck i was smoking back in grade seven i was a fucking savage i remember me and my friend like act like we were like we were, we were like we were like we needed to fidget with something we would always need to fidget with something so i remember the teacher she got her um like she, she got these fidget tools there was this little wooden thing that you would like move around in circles and they would follow it kind of and i remember my friend right he was using it right and he fucking broke it it was hilarious it was so funny and then also um oh wait, i won the game Holy shit, i went 30 and 6. yeah she had these uh fidget tools that were the fidget, fidget games or fidget toys i guess you could say there was one where you could open and like you can open and just close it was a little ball there was a little wooden thing that my friend broke and it was funny dude that that portable smelt so fucking bad for some reason and everybody says like oh it's been happening it's because of the teacher it's because of the teacher or whatever we went to um walmart right i bought these for this febreze thing i brought it i like i sprayed everything she's like sasha and he's like oh, yeah and she's like give it to me I'm like okay i'll get to her um i brought i brought this so because the room smells so bad or whatever and like i give it to her and then she's like she wants it right i'm like okay take it i guess she never fucking used it she never fucking used it. It smelled so bad in that room. I remember even even told the principal, the vice principal, because the vice principal back there in that school, we like we could we could talk to the vice principal like as like a as a like we kind of like as a student, I guess you could say. Like she wasn't like she didn't like use her powers above us or whatever. Like she was a really nice vice principal. And the principal, I remember one class, I think he always came in to watch the class and see out what Madame um whatever you want to say, Madame let's, let's call her Madame V. Madame, Madame V. We legit, we didn't do anything in that English class as well. I remember we would just read books. Fucking a hilarious thing was like, she got mad at us, right? Like sort of like she got, it was weird. Like she would always say like, you're not behaving, you're not behaving. But then whenever dude, whenever it's parent teacher interview, it's always like, Oh yeah, um, oh yeah, yeah, your, your, uh, your son and your daughter, she, they are so well behaved in your, in my class. They are so respectful. Like trying to suck up to our parents or whatever you could say. I don't even know. Cause like, obviously i told my mom how like stupid that class was and how much of a joke it was but obviously like they kind of knew about it right she would su she would suck up to all of our parents i even asked my friend elliot like did, did she suck up to your parents as well and she's like yep i mean she wasn't a, like a mean teacher like she wasn't a mean teacher at all actually I'm, I'm i'm not saying that she's a bad like a mean teacher she was actually a really nice teacher it was just that she was a very stupid teacher oh my god oh my this dude, this automaton is fucking good. I might need to make a video on this thing. Oh my god, I just remember something. I remember us talking to one of our grade six teachers about Madame Vucci, or almost said her fucking name, Madame V. And even he didn't like her. Like, I guess the teachers didn't even like like her that much. I guess like, at least that one teacher, because I remember that one teacher didn't like her. I don't even think she works there anymore. Cause we because like we went back um to our middle school or whatever um for our friend's birthday. Oh no, not, not our friend's birthday. We all like all of our friends, we just hung out and um we went to our middle school right because there are middle school honestly they're really chill like the vice principal and the principal they're really chill um so they let us come in and talk to everybody and everything we talked to like the cooking teacher woodwork teacher the music teacher and everything like that talked to our old teachers as well for grade eight and everything our great yeah grade eight teacher we went to go ask if madame v is there right and she's like um i don't think so she's not there um so i'm just guessing she got fired or she got or she quit or something or she moved i don't know i hope she didn't get fired because like i mean no she, i mean she wasn't a good teacher i mean she, she didn't teach she didn't teach i don't understand how she became our english teacher like how did that go through our like how did that even go through the middle school right you have your two class you have two teachers so you have two class your one teacher and your other teacher one teacher is your main class is where you would go eat lunch and everything because in middle school you have to still eat lunch in your class and then it's recess. All right, so the two teachers would be close together, to be close to with each other, right? Our teacher didn't even like think about um talking to the principal how that she's an English teacher for some reason. Hey, but that's it. Um, that has been the story of my stupidest teacher I've ever had. Yeah, I don't know what else to say. If you guys want to see other story time videos, I could definitely make them happen. I'm, I actually really enjoy doing this whole talking down, sitting down, talking about a story actually yeah, i actually really enjoyed doing this so if you guys want to see it let's uh break like 10 likes uh, i'll do it again what else can i say i don't know see you guys